Hi, and welcome to StampingSmiles.com. I'm Shelley Godby, the owner and CEO of Stamping Smiles. And it's finally here. The Stampin' Trimmer is finally here, and I am so excited to show you all the great features to this exclusive trimmer from Stampin' Up. So come and watch. You're going to want to see this. is a good look at the newly released worth waiting for exclusively designed by Stampin' Up! Stampin' Trimmer with many many great features so let's just jump right in. One of my absolute favorite features about this is that we can lock the guide in place, the cutting and scoring guide, and so when you put your cardstock in it helps for it to sit still so it doesn't move on you. We just put in your cardstock up against the stock, and then poop. And then while we're talking about features, look at this, the Whisper White cardstock. It actually cut through it. It doesn't look like I gnawed it with my teeth. That was an issue with the other cutter. It's exactly what it looked like. And so now the Very Vanilla and Whisper White cardstock so far are just cutting beautifully with this. And so we have that to lock it in place. You don't have to, but I sure like that feature. And look at this, this curves in, just making it so much more comfortable to hang on to when you need to carry it or whatever. Reminds me of the laundry baskets when they finally put that curve in because we always put it on our hip. Just that much more comfortable. And let's go ahead and turn this over. We have the no slip grips. So when you place that on your table. And look at this storage area in the bottom. So if you're going off somewhere or you just want to keep your room neat and tidy, lots of room here to your bone folder will fit in there and other goodies. Just think of all the things you can store there <laughs> or hide from kids. <laughs> okay, and um, look at this extension arm. It comes out. I'm going to hold this up for you. Okay, so it goes to 14 and 5 eighths inches, yay, so longer than the 12 by 12 if you happen to have a piece that's bigger. But look at this, inside the hinge there's even a marking. So this is at 6 and a half. So <laughs> how great is that? So we didn't lose all that area and have to guess. Fantastic! So when you don't need that, you just put that in place. Um, look at this, we have a stop at the top, so it just stops for us, but not just at the top, at the bottom too. And this is really important because um, with this extra long cutting area, we can now do 12 by 12 paper or cardstock without, and we can just lock that in place once we're happy with where it is. Look, we can cut from either end. We do not have to remove our cutting or scoring blade if we wanted to cut from the other end or score from the other end. I like to leave one at the bottom and one at the top all the time and with this, with the 12 by 12 I don't have to separate them, which I always felt was loosening them up and making it easy for them to fall out. No longer do we have to do that because we could just leave our cutting and scoring blades in there all the time because lock that in place and just score right over top of that and see there's room for it. That is fantastic. And that we have the stops at the bottom is great because like I said, I like to leave the scoring um, blade down here and I can go out to five and a half inches because this whole cutting area is bigger than it ever was. So when I put in my cardstock to score, and in this case it would be four and a quarter, that wasn't an issue with the old one but five and a half was. I was always having to turn those around to get the scoring blade to the top. Well, with this longer cutting area, this surface, no longer an issue. Love that! <laughs> so, just, oh, and um, another thing that I really like about this, so like I said, that stop at the bottom, so I can easily use both of those. I'm getting all excited. But then I can cut small pieces of cardstock. With the old one, I had to glue it down but so this, if I want to cut, so you have, you've done this, you've had a one inch strip, you needed a half inch out of it. 
and you just want to cut it. You just want to start over with a whole new big piece. It's like, I've got all these scraps. Why can't I just use this? Well, look. That locking in place allows it. It didn't move on there for me. And so now, because there are just times where you know you've had this. This has happened to you. So, <laughs> loving, loving, loving it. Uh, let's do our quick review of it. We have the cutting and the scoring blade included. Yes! We have the ability to lock the cutting guide in place to help hold our cardstock. We have this nice curve, so it is just so much more comfortable to hang on to. We can cut out to over 14 inches. Actually, we have a measurement out to 14 and 5 eighths with a marking in the hinge. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Stops at the top and the bottom because our cutting area is so large, even when doing the 12 by 12 paper, we no longer have to switch the, the blades around. So we can leave the cutting always at the top or the bottom and the scoring just the opposite because we have the room to do that for both of these to sit on there even at the top together and still be able to do what we want, the cutting or the scoring. And let's not forget our storage on the bottom. Wasn't that brilliant? It was just wasted space. It was so smart. And then our feet, so it's just not sliding all over the place. The new exclusively designed by Stampin' Up! Stampin' Trimmer gives has two thumbs up from Shelly. Love it. So tickled with it. You know, I know you're going to want one, so go to my online store now. It's available for you to order. You can go and order it now, and so this will just make your paper crafting so much more enjoyable when you have a great tool like this on hand. Uh, my store is stampinsmiles.stampinup.net. I have it under the screen, or on the screen right here. Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> or, you know what, under the screen I'll have a clickable link right to the Stampin' Trimmer in my online Stampin' Up! store, so you can go ahead and order that right now for me. So, uh, this is Shelly Godby. Very excited about this new product. Very happy to be able to show you about it. So go purchase one at my online store. And again, this is Shelly Godby teaching you how to create hand stamp smiles. Thanks for watching.